Hey guys, Dave here. <clears throat> I just uh, want to do a video on video cameras. Um, any of you out there that are looking for a cheap HD camera, I just picked this up today. If you guys are in an area where they have these stores, big lots. They had this uh, Kodak Mini HD. I don't know what the model is. Doesn't say. Oh yeah, it does. ZM2. Okay, when this camera first came out, I looked at it. I think it was like a hundred bucks. Um, so I saw it on sale at one point at Best Buy for fifty. And I already have a couple cameras, but I like having a secondary one, backup one, whatever. Um, this was on sale for thirty nine ninety nine. And so I went and got one today. <clears throat> it's waterproof up to 10 feet. I have a playing sport, which works great underwater. Shoots 720p. Easy upload to YouTube, Facebook. Um, it comes with a 2 gig card, micro SD. Um, so let's take a look at it. I already opened it, charged the battery. In the box, you don't get much. box manual camera wrist strap you can see it's tiny um, pluses on it as far as I could tell it's 40 bucks on sale if you can get one at the big lots uh, minuses, no tripod connection, um, microphone seems pretty weak, it's really tiny which is great. If you wanted something just to throw in your pocket to take on the run and not have to worry about getting wet. Like I said, I have a uh, playing sport for size comparison. Okay, um, and the underwater capability, if it works anything like the playing sport, it's awesome. Again, as the best camera you're going to get, no. But for 40 bucks, 10 feet uh, waterproof capability, um, it's got a built in battery. Here's the. Uh, there's the other thing I didn't really like about it. It's got this kind, if you guys are into those flip things, you're probably familiar with this. Um, I would definitely buy an adapter, like a cable for it, because when I tried charging it today on the PC that I had available to me, it um, the USB connection was recessed, so this wouldn't fit in. I did find a PC that, <clears throat> this will fit no problem in my laptop. So this comes in, comes out, it locks out, then to retract it, push the button in, and it locks back in. Then you have included. Wow, that's small. Oh, two gig. Micro SD card. Um, again, like I said, it doesn't have a mount for a tripod, although I did see a guy put up a video. He kind of rigged it on his. But, you know, I like, sometimes I like to take it on a motorcycle. Don't want my wife dropping the camera. This is going to fit that bill perfectly. The underwater capability, I think, is awesome. Uh, I saw some videos people put up online. The microphone is a little lacking. But, again, if you're just screwing around, it's perfect for 40 bucks. You want a first camera, a second camera, you want to buy one for the kids, but don't want to break the bank. It is perfect fit. And again, if you guys are near a, uh, I, just, I checked Kodak's website tonight when I got home, and uh, it's still listed on there for 180. 
they have a non-HD model for a hundred bucks on their website. Comes in a bunch of colors. They had a few of them. They had like a red one, a blue, maybe a green. This is gray. I don't know how well that uh, door will hold up over time, but we'll see. A little dark in the garage tonight. So, I'll post up some video of That's the Kodak playing sport. That's Samsung HMX Q10. Really happy with that camera for the price. I think you can get it for about 250 still. And that's it. So I will talk to you guys later. That's the Kodak playing sport. That's Samsung HMX Q10. Really happy with that camera for the price. I think you can get it for about 250 still. And that's it.